Wake Up Soft by Anouk Boys Robert and Louis Regard Text by Sophie Strade Roaring Book Press, New York Everything is green and lush in the forest. The birds chirp, the cats lounge in the shade of the trees, <coughs> the ant eaters eat bugs as if they were sucking them up with a straw and a saw. Do you see him? Sways gently among the trees. Hmm. Where is he? Hmm. Only oh, see a monkey. People. Wait. Hmm. He's brown. The sloth first found stone. An eater porcupine parrot. There's sloth. Oh, all the way back there. Oh my god. Suddenly, a loud clang rings out from the edge of the forest. The cry of a toucan splits the air. But the sloth, do you see him, goes on with his nap. He's still at the same spot. Oh yeah, he is. What's happening? The forest trembles. Machines with terrible iron teeth uproot the trees. Birds abandon their nests. But the sloth, do you see him? Dreams and hears nothing. <laughs> still there. People and animals flee. With an awful noise, the machines destroy the forest. The sloth, still sleeping, turns over and yawns. Do you see him? Still there. Wait, we skipped a page. Every... Only one tree is left. Soon there will be none. Wake up, sloth. Run away. Run. Uh -huh. Everything is brown and bare. A man comes, like you. He misses the animals and er, the birds that used to sing. The soft breeze that used to whisper in the leaves of the trees. He works hard to heal the wounded soil. He brings seeds and plants them. And plants them. Soon, little seedlings push up through the soil. Look, do you see him? The sloth is back. Whoa. He is back. <laughs> Whoa. In the forest, everything is green and lush. And the sloth always... The sloth sways gently among the leaves. There. There. So small. The end.